I'm Rob Johnson. And I'm Erica Sargent. But we begin with a billionaire battle and campaign 2016. He's already taken on immigrants, the disabled, and the Pope. Now Donald Trump has launched a Twitter war against the Ricketts, the family that owns the Chicago Cubs. Here's CBS 2's Derek Blakely on what's behind Trump's latest battle. They're not just fans of the Chicago Cubs, they own the team. But the Ricketts are no fans of Donald Trump, and now he knows it. Our principal's pack paid for and is responsible for the content of this advertising. In Iowa, New Hampshire, and South Carolina, the Our Principal Super PAC flooded the airways with TV ads taking Trump to task. In many cases, I probably identify more as a Democrat. But it was only revealed Friday that Marlene Ricketts, wife of Ameritrade founder Joe Ricketts, is principal supporter of the Stop Trump effort, contributing $3 million. Today, Trump tweeted, I hear the Ricketts family, who own the Chicago Cubs, are secretly spending dollars against me. They better be careful. They have a lot to hide. Some Illinois Republicans not amused. I think he's an idiot. I mean, this is what he does. He goes into each state, he goes into this, engages in this Twitter war, and he sucks all the air out of the room so the other candidates can't talk about the important issues. But reformers complain that the super rich can pour millions into super PACs, producing attack ads like these, while hiding for weeks exactly who is paying the bill. In the case of this super PAC um, that was spending against Donald Trump, they've been spending money for two months, but they haven't reported a donor until three days ago. And we think that that's something that really should be changed. The Ricketts family had no response to Trump's tweet, but over the weekend, Marlene Ricketts said Trump was too unpredictable to be president. Of course, it's exactly that unpredictability and blunt talk which fuels Trump's appeal. To be tested here in the Illinois GOP primary, now little more than three weeks away. Hang on to your hats. Reporting live from the newsroom, Derek Blakely, CBS2 News. Rob and Erica. All right, Derek, thank you.